things that we've uh, fully smooshed. Those absolutely pathetic Republican guards who tried to take us out. Grace still dealing heavy damage. And now onwards to the bridge. Where Garzel and that traitorous bastard Edmund await. So many enemies still. Right, now I'm going to send Eldar over once again, being relegated to lesser duties. But hey, you're the one with the wings, mate. key is to lure these wind knights because they're holding spears and if they go after Eldar that's big trouble. Spears and swords do not mix. So hopefully we can draw them in but not with Symbius. Just in the bow night, he is very shite. Just in the bow night, don't use him. The game forces him on you at this point. Should have run away, son. Yeah, just reiterate, I would never be so brazen if these guys were unpromoted by now. It would be real bad news. Luckily, Elroy still has that uh, ring, the life ring. We're just keeping him nice and tucked up. Right. Yeah, so the monks, as healers, they're they're so-so. But it's not it's not really until later on when they start getting support magic that they they come into their own. And boy, do they come into their own! They they, they can be game changers. Okay, we've got some movement with the. Right now, I'm going to break the healer's unspoken law and heal myself. I don't care. You can't let a lovely lady like that walk around with a bruise on her face. Buzzard. Actually, I did that on purpose because if you stand right at the edge of that cliff, there's a high possibility that the bird knights will stop because they can attack from a distance, which, like, like that, which leaves you very uh, limited in your options for attacking. Wow, wow, that was that was some pain that was brought there. I like how like with the tomahawks and and stuff they, 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 they make sure that they bounce back. But with spears they don't really have an idea of how to get them back so they just say, Oh fuck it and uh, <laughs> and they just um, they just make them reappear as if as if by magic. 
Uh, should I stand in there? Yeah, no one's gonna come get me. I have actually got the level 1 special on knives now, because I had to restart and I ran on mansion and made sure I got level 1, because I needed a bit more juice. Um, but we haven't seen that yet, I don't think. Wow! Wow, see that? That's the friendship there. See? I stood Dantares next to Symbius. And, um, that gave him an attack bonus. So even with just a regular attack, he was able to take out. Take out a Megalodon in one go. Further exemplifying how shite Megalodons are. Yeah, so we're still not getting all together that much experience, but um, in the next few chapters what tends to happen is you, you'll get, I mean wing knights give you good experience, but you tend to get um, just points where enemies will give you a massive load of experience and you all level up really quickly and then you'll come across enemies who give you no experience and you don't level up at all. Justin can actually kill someone! Yeah. Actually, if I'm going to get rid of him by the next battle, I should have given that experience to someone who I'm just going to keep. Alas, you live, you learn, as Alanis once said. You live, you learn, and then the rest of the song, I don't know. There was some moaning, I believe. Yay, they left me alone. I'm gonna go get my gonna go get my chest now. And inside that chest is the white ring. Which is a very useful little item for those of us with limited defensive capability. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm Gonna heal my boy Symbius. Still no levels yet. Getting close, getting close. Uh, yeah, yeah. Revenge. Not bad, not bad. Irene! Oh, go on, you've earned it, love. The weakness against wind magic there being key. And that's the end of them suckers.